Good morning. It is about 6 a.m. That's my usual wake up time now. Uh, I've decided to put a what I ate in a day on the Hot for Food channel. See how it does. And this is a special one because I am partnering with Ritual to bring you this episode of what I ate in a day. Um, I just got back from a trip to Italy in the mail when I arrived back. I did get my uh, ritual in the mail. I take the postnatal multivitamin. I've been taking that obviously since I had my son. If you watch my other channel, you've seen that I've worked with Ritual in the past many times. Um, at that time I was taking the women's multivitamin and then they actually created a prenatal vitamin and postnatal vitamin just in time for me. <laughs> so I've been using Ritual for a while. They're a brand I can trust because of the transparency around the ingredients they use. For their packaging, they also use 100% recycled materials. The mailer, like the one I just got, is made from recycled newsprint and plant fiber, and they even use plant-based ink. So this is it, the Ritual Essential Postnatal that I take. It has 15 essential nutrients that are important after pregnancy. Everyone focuses on the prenatal vitamin. Your doctor obviously focused on that if you experienced this before, the folic acid and that kind of thing and getting a prenatal. It's important, but most people don't realize that the postpartum period is even more nutritionally demanding, whether you're breastfeeding or not. I did breastfeed, so I decided I was gonna take something like this and just swap it for the multi. And I'm actually weaning off breastfeeding at the moment, but I'm still taking this. And you take two easy to take capsules a day. The Ritual Postnatal contains things like zinc and vitamin C, as well as biotin iodine, choline, all to support nutrients you need during lactation. Also has omega-3 DHA and all Ritual products are vegan friendly, non-GMO, gluten-free, allergen free and contain no added sugar. This is a delivered to your door subscription as you saw with the package I just got. And if you're not in the pre or postnatal phase, uh, they also offer other products like multivitamins for women, men, teens and 50 plus. They have a minty fresh flavor so they're super easy to swallow. I take them first thing in the morning so I don't forget every day and that's one of my healthy habits. I guess in addition to making coffee first thing. Um, but you can start a brand new ritual as well and get 30% off your very first month of ritual. Use my link in the description below and my code. Uh, it's 30% off for the month of July. So I'm up early on basically a free day. I will document what I am eating. I am starving because I got in late last night and uh, didn't eat, went right to bed, you know, wanted to delay or, or fix the jet lag problem. So let's see what we have. I think I have some vegan egg. Yes, I do. Toast. I had a tomato in the fridge that I just have to cut the top off and a grapefruit. That's pretty good for being away for two weeks. I just wanted to make it fast, <clears throat> not necessarily gourmet. Mm hmm I guess it wasn't very clear. My son is with his dad today since I just got back last night. Figured I'd be tired. Although, at the moment I feel energized, but that's a trick. <laughs> mm. I wasn't really sure about this grapefruit. It's still good. It just has a very thick membrane, so I'm sort of eating around them. How I do my what I ate in a day is I just go on a journey. I don't know what I'm eating today. We shall see. And you get to come along for the ride. I needed another coffee. I have a lot of work to do today. Gotta launch my membership. So there's a hot for food membership. I don't know if y'all are aware of that. Basically you pay for exclusive content including now vlogs that you won't see anywhere else, obviously exclusive recipes. And this latest issue is called the travel issue. So it's recipes inspired by my travels uh, with the Getaway Co, which is the company that I work with to promote vegan holidays. 
and we'll be announcing my 2024 schedule soon, but I'll tell you I'm going to Morocco in 2024 in the spring and then we will be doing Live With Purpose Bali again. Not sure if it'll be in June or October. So if you wanna come on a vegan holiday with myself and The Getaway Co, which is a company run by my best friend, Amanda, you should come. So go to thegetawayco.com for more. The updated schedule might not be there just this uh, moment, but you can sign up for her newsletter and then get the announcement as soon as it's there. If you wanna sign up for my membership, go to the link below, members.hotforfoodblog.com. Sign up for an annual membership. It's the best bang for your buck. You get a 14 day free trial where you get access to all the content. And for the travel issue, there is a vlog about my son's birthday. So the members do get to see my son. And <clears throat> from time to time, there's other content with him as well. Also a vlog from Vancouver. I spent 48 hours in Vancouver. So I have what I ate there. Um, I've also got really great recipes that you can check out. And I would really love your support. If you're a big hot for food, hot for foodie, I should say, um, support the membership. It goes directly to me. I don't use a third party. Um, it's just a way to support what I do beyond the free content that you get here on YouTube and the blog, uh, of which I still post to both. So that is still there. And I do giveaways and member discounts. You also get added to my IG close friends list where you see behind the scenes of what I'm working on throughout the year. And who knows, I add things to it all the time. I modify it based on things you want. You get to be part of the feedback and the content creation. So I think it's a pretty good deal. Okay, I'm just sitting here working away, writing a bunch of blog posts. And uh, I should eat something. It's 10.30. Like, getting up early is a problem because you end up eating more. Like, four meals a day. I just have some white cheddar vegan puffs that I'll snack on. Mmm. I'm going to need something else to eat here. I got this on the plane yesterday. I get a vegan meal, and this is a vegan raspberry, Odi raspberry bar. Yeah, it's all right. Gluten-free oats, golden date juice, coconut oil, oat flour, muscovado sugar, sultanas, ground flax, icing sugar, freeze-dried raspberries, water, and sea salt. I feel like I should make something like this. Okay, I did some yoga outside. I It's pretty hot today. I eat at weird times. It's now 2.45. I have, oh, the laundry's going. <clears throat> I have some tomatoes from my garden, from my lettuce grow, so we'll eat those. And then why don't I try these? Beer battered plant-based fish fillets from Trader Joe's, gluten-free and vegan. Jackfruit and king oyster mushrooms. Look at them. Actually, I like the size. These are big. Okay, well you definitely have to cook these fish things way longer than it says in the oven and at a hotter temperature so that they get the oil coming out and then they start kind of like frying basically in the pan. I made the garden tomatoes with some frozen corn, uh, some kale and greens from the garden, and I just added a uh, red onion. And then I have this like balsamic reduction stuff that I got in Italy. So I added that and salt and pepper and olive oil. Tasty. Put some hemp hearts on top there. Let's try this fish filet. Put some of my sauce on there. Oh yeah, the sauce I just did, uh, I had two little pickle slices left. I put that in with some vegan mayo, some of the pickle juice. And then I had this sandwich sauce. This is from a restaurant in Zurich. Um, it's from Zurich, a place called Veganitas. So I just mix that in to thicken it up. Tastes delicious. Interesting, it's very hot. Not bad. They kind of have like a mashed potato texture, so that's slightly disappointing, but they're good, they taste good. Air fryer would probably be best to cook these. I got rid of my air fryer, it broke. So I don't have one. This little tomato salad's very good. See you for dinner. Okay, I've done a lot of work today. It's almost seven. I never said this was a video on how to eat vegan. It's just what I eat. <laughs> and sometimes I don't eat dinner. 
I just eat snacks. So we'll see. But I'm just gonna catch up on some TV. Oh, I'm watching The Bear season two. So good. You know what show is not good? The Idol. Terrible. I have to finish it though. <laughs> okay, so this is my little weird dinner. I just cooked up some frozen broccoli with sesame oil, some red onion, uh, this sweet soy sauce, and then cooked that and added some sesame seeds on top. And then I just made one of these Trader Joe's scallion pancakes, which are my favorite. It only takes a few minutes in a hot pan to cook on both sides. And it's a pretty light dinner, but it's all I feel like eating. Tofu would have been good, but all my tofu was frozen. Mmm, simple, delicious. And that is what I ate in a day. You can get 30% off your first month of Ritual by clicking this QR code, going to my link here, ritual.com slash hotforfood30 and enter code hotforfood30 at checkout. Thanks for watching.